Overnight, a customer spotted three children alone inside of a car at a Walmart parking lot in Lauderdale Lakes. According to police, the children had been left unattended for seven hours. Now their mother and a man are facing serious charges. CBS source Gabby Fleischman joins us live with the story. Gabby. Elliot, employees at that Walmart tell me that a customer actually saw those kids in the car hysterically crying at 2 o'clock in the morning. Now the kids' mom and her boyfriend are still in jail right now. They had a bond hearing earlier this morning, and they could be released at any minute. A mother accused of leaving her three children waiting in the car while she and her boyfriend shoplifted from Walmart tells a judge in court she has another baby on the way. I have three small children and I'm currently pregnant. 30 year old Toshiba Hope and 24 year old Gerald Moultrie are facing grand theft and child neglect charges. The Broward Sheriff's Office says the couple left Hope's kids ages 2, 5, and 7 alone in the parking lot of this Walmart on 441 and Oakland Park Boulevard in Lauderdale Lakes. According to the arrest report, the pair got caught stealing tools and car accessories from the store. Allegedly stole tools and accessories from Walmart, $660. They were taken into custody at around 7 Monday night. According to deputies, the duo never mentioned that the kids were in the car. It wasn't until 2 the next morning that employees say a customer noticed the kids crying in the back seat of the car and called 911. They made a poor judgment, that's it. They should have used it. the common sense. At least if they get arrested, Tell the police and let the family member come and pick up your kids. Don't make no sense. That's completely irresponsible. First of all, you're stealing with your kids in the car and then you don't even tell the police that they're in the car to begin with. Since the children weren't found until seven hours after the arrest, the neglect charges still had not been added before the couple's court appearance. Unaware of what happened with the kids, the judge released them. We release you on your own recognizance. Thank you. Don't go back to Walmart. According to investigators, the kids weren't hurt, just shaken up. Child Protective Services says right now they're being cared for by relatives. We're live from Fort Lauderdale, Gabby Fleischman, CBS4 News.